Call on tonight from our News 8 investigation into rising Eversource disconnects. News 8's George Colley reported in February that the number of Eversource customers shut offs for non payment nearly doubled in two years. Tonight, George reports that both U.S. senators from Connecticut are calling for an investigation. U.S. Senator Richard Blumenthal wrote this letter to the president and CEO of Eversource asking for a detailed explanation for the rapid rise in disconnects from 2015 to 2017. The News 8 investigators reported exclusively in February that the number of Eversource customers shut off for non payment rose from nearly 29,000 in 2015 to more than 52,000 in 2017. Our report came on the heels of a call by State Senator Len Suzio to have the Public Utilities Regulatory Authority, or PURA, investigate inaccurate billing by third party energy suppliers. Senator Blumenthal asked Eversource to ensure that household incomes that fall 300% below the poverty line are being exempted from being shut off, as well as those households on public assistance or with serious illnesses, disabilities, or children. In the letter, Blumenthal writes, electricity is a critical, often vital service for Connecticut residents. It is extremely important that families and residents are not needlessly harmed by a company's attempt to reduce its accounts receivables. Blumenthal asked for an answer by the end of business today. Eversource tells me they will be responding to the senator's letter. Just last week, Senator Chris Murphy cited our investigation in a call for Pura to investigate the rise in disconnects and to consider the increase when scrutinizing Eversource's request for a rate increase next month. Pura is still taking public comments regarding the rate increase until the end of the day tomorrow. George Colley, News 8.